Hey, it's Heather Davis, another edition of Thursday with Molly from Saving Grace. And this sweet girl sitting on the chair is Mardi Gras. Oh my yeah. gosh, she is a doll. She is. She's usually more of a party than this. <laughs> she was over a party now, apparently. She must be party now. <laughs> yeah. But so sweet. So tell me more she about is. her. So what do we know about her? So she came to Saving Grace with a litter of newborn puppies. So, Aww. yep. So she was in a foster program a and a foster home for about uh, eight weeks until she winged the pups and mm -hmm. then came back for adoption. So she's adopted or available for adoption now. She's ready for a home of her she own, is. right? You're ready to party in a home of she your is. own. <laughs> she's a really smart dog. So uh -huh. she seems a little overwhelmed here, but usually she's really active mm -hmm. and just eager to find any of the volunteers to uh -huh. throw a ball, play with yeah. her, and she is all about learning some new tricks. Yeah, and she loves the treats too. She loves so. the treats too. Yeah. yeah, she's a treat girl. That's my kind of girl. <laughs> <laughs> she is. So what do we recommend for a home? Obviously, if she's she's not a big dog, she's you know, but she might fill out a little She'll bit more. She'll fill out a little bit, yeah. Uh -huh. She came in really thin, and then nursing the pups took took a lot out of her as it usually does with the mama dog. So uh -huh. once they wing the pups, they tend to fill out quite a bit more. So somebody who definitely wants a really interactive dog, mm -hmm. a real companion, because she is not a sit on the couch, couch potato. She this does, is not normal. We, no. we pooped her out. We yeah, apparently so, pooped her out before. And us. she's been outside playing a lot this afternoon. So that's why. Yeah. Yeah. But I'll she do it. is, you know, she's active. She's great on the leash, great for walking, mm -hmm. hiking. Um, and like I said, just learns everything. She's mm -hmm. not at all a lazy girl. She's a smart girl too. She is. You're she's about two girl. years old. Okay, great. Excellent. Well, we will uh, put all of her information below. Oh, you guys have any events coming up now that the weather is getting nice outside, right? So we still have our host weekends every mm -hmm. weekend, our sleepovers. So that's where you pick up a dog on Friday and bring them back on Sunday night or Monday morning. Mm -hmm. And then we also have a open house coming up on Friday, April 28th. Mm -hmm. Make sure I have my date right. April gotcha. 28th. Excellent. Two weeks from, from now. Seven. Yep. yep. We have a food truck there. It's a really good time just to come out and see everything we do. Mm -hmm. If people are interested in volunteering, you can speak with different people on different volunteer opportunities or fostering or just meet lots of dogs. You don't have to be willing to commit to adopt or volunteer, you can just come and get a lot of dog love. Yes, get all the yeah. puppy love. Yeah, you can always <laughs> bring um, a donation. We do a supply drive on the same day as the open house. Mm -hmm. So we uh, right now our greatest need would be canned food. Okay. So we, we do use a lot of canned food with puppies and some of the adults who maybe aren't eating as well as they um, as we want them to. Yeah. So they they go through a lot of canned food and linens, blankets, and towels are always a big one. Um, a lot of people will kind of collaborate with their neighborhood and collect all the used blankets and oh, towels. Oh, yeah, because think about how much you, I mean, you're yeah. doing spring cleaning anyway, Doing spring right? cleaning yeah. is a great time, and nothing needs to be new or nice. We yes. just ask that it's clean, but it doesn't need to be new or nice, and anything from just sheets and towels to um, blankets are great. Awesome. Well, excellent. We'll put all that information below, as well as Marty Cross information, and thanks so much for watching Thursday.